and it's all the way from Stockton on Tees, which is where we are, it's the beginning of, uh, on the 13th of November or 14th of I'm November, over the river. the penultimate quiz, and, it, uh, yeah, and it's so. Michael McPartland who is trying to gain on his friend Clive here. <laughs> <laughs> TV zone, Michael McPartland. Mr. TV. <laughs> Let's do this thing, Michael. <laughs> okay, number one. 43 German teams have won the Champions League or European Cup. Bayern Munich and Borussia Dortmund. Mike. 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 Is it correct? Minus one. Oh, Rose. Oh, no. Stuttgart. Incorrect. Uh, me. Hamburg. Hamburg. Hamburg is correct. Yes. Oh. Oh. Uh, so let's just have a look at these scores here. Oh, 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 check it! Uh, Rose and Mike get I was hoping he wasn't saying Borussia Dortmund. Mike is. That's Mike and Rose. And Rose. Oh, closing in on, on the new visual. And that's it, that's round. <laughs> right, ready? You, yeah, let's start. Uh, directed by Dave Stewart from the Eurythmics, the 2000 film Honest features three members of which girl band in the lead world? Uh, Martin. Martin. Oh, Martin. Martin. correct. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, Due to premiere in November 2015, Andrew Lloyd Webber's latest musical is based on which 2003 film starring Jack Black? Ah! Mike? Got to School of Rock. School of Rock, yeah. Right, number four. How many Olympic gold medals has Mark Spitz won? Ah! Oh. Sam? Nine. Nine is correct, yeah. Two in 1968, seven in 72. Two parts of Sam. Uh, a Christmas Carol was Charles Dickens' first Christmas book. Which book, subtitled The Goblin Story, was his second? Lake on. Lake on. Cricket on the Half? That's incorrect. Uh, Clive, nothing away. The Chimes? The Chimes. Oh. Oh. <sighs> you've oh, this round, Clive. Yeah. You've necked one this round, haven't you? No. You've one this round. No. no. It's tried everything. First time was it? Well, <laughs> how come I've got you down as a. Sorry. I must have pressed the wrong, wrong answer. Oh, you must have pressed those, Steve. No, I must have pressed uh, the more than not the two. Right. Oh, yeah, I'm keeping a break here. <laughs> <laughs> Number six. I'm on 12. Uh, in 2014, Reynard Lavanier became. <laughs> Sam. Sam. Paul Vaughan. Paul Vaughan, yeah. I thought you pronounced it wrong. I probably have used Reynard Lavanier. Yeah. Lavin, yeah. yeah. No. Mm -hmm. Wasn't sure. Right. In 1973 and 75, Bill Hartson won the British Chess Championship, and throughout the 80s we had a series of programmes about chess. Mm -hmm. However, since 2013... Uh, Lake on! Box. Box. Yeah. He's always there with a great big pair of painted boobs behind him. <laughs> yeah, he is, yeah. yeah. Um, Jarvis Island, Baker Island, Northern Mariana Islands, Wake Island, Midway Island. Sam. No. Uh, just one moment. Oops, sorry, I've, I've done the an extra one there. Preston. Preston. Antarctica. Is incorrect. Uh, my Five. next one. Marianas. Incorrect. Uh, Guam and Puerto Rico are all territories going into which country? Mm. Mexico. No, kids, kids, kids. USA. USA, yeah. Mm. Oh, I'll give myself two extra, sorry. Oh, good. Right, in what year did the following happen? Alice Cooper, Sven Goran Eriksson, and Olivia Newton John were born. The Berlin blockade begins. Lake Up. In 1961. Is that no, correct? Uh, former Prime Minister of Japan during World War II, Hideki Tojo, was executed for crimes against humanity. Thomas Dewey is defeated in the US presidential election by Harry S. Truman. And London hosts the first Summer Olympic Games. That is Sam. 48. 48, yeah. That's a close one, but I'll tell you what I'm Always laughing. His only legitimate son, William Adamin, died in the White Ship. So that's Henry the Third. Henry the Third. Henry the Third. Henry the Third. First. Third. Yeah, first. Okay. Worried <laughs> 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 me for a second, man. I've already Henry the Third. He did! Right, uh, next one, number 11. When expressed in terms of the Roman alphabet, which letter of the Greek alphabet begins with the letter U? It's Martin. 
That's no upside on you. Yeah. Uh, Martin gets three points. Lost track of that. The Iron Sheik. It's my Lego. WWE wrestling? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, oh, it's it's that going to be? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Macho Man Randy Savage. Sergeant Slaughter. The Undertaker. Yokozuna and Triple H. Out of six people to have been beaten by this wrestler. Ah! That, I can't read that. Mike. Is it Randy Orton? Is it correct? Ah! He's a minus one still. Yeah. Uh, Who's that next? Debs. Debs. John Cena. No. Steve Rose. Rose. No. <laughs> there are six people to have been beaten by which wrestler for him to win his six WWE World Titles? <laughs> Sam. Sam. Lesnar. No. Oh, yeah. Is that, is that, are we finished? Yeah, yeah. yeah I finished the question. I've been for Sam. Steve Rose. No. <laughs> Anyone else? Get a wrestler? Is it? Let's go. Oh, no, not let's go. Two or three. No, no. Tell me when you finish. No, no, get guesses? No, no. Mark, do you know that? No, it's been long. Both talking, yeah. Uh, yeah. Before mentioned, yeah. Oh, well. Fucking uh, hell. I, I, I just jumped months. into it quick. I don't know why I was worried because no one else had even got there. Well, now I had to pop the present for that. Uh, made a World Heritage Site in 2003 and located in the Pernalulu National Park in Western Australia. What is the name of the range of beehive shaped sandstone towers? Ah! That's Mike. The Bungle Bungles. The Bungle oh, Bungles. Yes. Yes. Mike. Puts you on two this round, Mike. Hell yeah. Um, what is the modern name of the country which between 1946 and 71 was a member of the UN Security Council alongside USA, USSR, UK and France? In 1971 they were not only replaced on the Security Council, they were also expelled from the UN. Hi, John. Incorrect. So okay. No. Sam? Rhodes? No. Vietnam? No. Mike? Uganda? No. Preston? Preston? North Korea? No. Mike Lakeup? Zimbabwe? No. Steve Kidd? Myanmar? No. Go on. No. Taiwan? Go on. Uh, the Republic of China. Yes. Yeah. 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 The proper Chinese. Yeah. 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 Um, invented in 1884, a device called the Acme Thunderer. Uh, that is. Press the, it's the referee's whistle. Yeah, it's a whistle. Yeah. yeah. Football. Excellent press. answer. The kind of answer you give when everybody goes <laughs> when you said that, <laughs> but nobody. Yeah. Yeah. Granddad was a railway guard, and he's got a, a, a whistle. I've got it. Uh, in the last 2,500 years, eight battles have taken place at this location, with the last being a German victory over Australian New Zealand force in 1941. The most famous battle was the first and took place in 480 BC. Which battle of the Persian Wars saw a small army led by Leonidas? Kid? Kid. Thermopylae? Thermopylae, yeah. 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 Oh, that's pear, pear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that, that felt good. <laughs> Number 17. Jared Butler. Go on. Hmm. It is the northernmost territory of the country it belongs to, has a population of over, over 260,000 people. Lying off the coast of Cameroon, the island Bioko, sometimes amusingly called Fernando Poo, the capital city of Malabo can be found on this island, which country is it? Long Poo. Sorry? Spain. No. Five. Rhodes. Minus, minus one. Rhodes. Um, Give me this side. No. Which country is it? Still didn't get a chance to finish. Yep, Preston? Still, still no. Senegal? No. Still still minus it. Uh, Steve Kidd? Preston? Equatorial Guinea. Equatorial Guinea. Listen, yeah. Sam, I wasn't trying to buy time there, but you know what I mean? I'm going through it. Why did I say? Because you know we're dishing me, because I'm in front of everybody on this guy. Go. Right. Well, next number 18. My dog's got Malibu as well. No. Yeah, it's. His, fil his roles in film and TV include Captain Flint in Black Sails, Oliver in the Clanelar Lawn, Kim Philby in Cambridge Spies, and the main villain Gustav Graves in Dying of the Day. Ah! It's a... Uh, oh, it's a gold. Uh -oh. No. Sam Gong. No. Who's next? Sam. Stevens. No. Stevens, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Totally yeah. Stevens. Mike yeah. get losers. Sam gets two. Really oh, Sam. I've got to read that one week. Go on. Yeah, that's what it is. Uh, Alexander Lukashenko 
is the current president. <laughs> Clive Belarus. Belarus, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was uh, on the bloody thing, wasn't it? At 30, Clive, is that right for you? Sorry. I wouldn't have a clue. <laughs> well, I think if I hey, press it, if it's on highlighted, free, if it's on free for this round. Anyway. If it's highlighted, it's good, isn't it? Let go. Uh, Sorry, right, right. Question twenty: Which metal forms the alloys tumbago with copper, rhodite with rhodium, and electrum with silver? Uh, it's Clive. Oh, 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 yeah. Point one two. You're on five this round, Clive. Uh, what is the name of a skiing resort which was used for the bobsled at the 1968 Grenoble Winter Olympics? The event had to be held at night as the venue had insufficient cooling equipment to keep the ice solid during the day. Since 1976, it has become much more famous for regularly hosting parts of an annual... Nice kid. I'm going to go for the crest of the room. No. Nope. Nice the one. So I have to go for that. Since 1976, it has become much more famous for regularly hosting part of an annual summer sporting event. Including, 20, including 2015, which French skiing resort has been hosted 26... Debs. Val de No, one away. Hosted 26 mountain top stages of the Tour de France, and it's considered to be... Preston. Preston. Alp d'Huez. Alp Ah, oh, we should have waited. Uh, which famous school was founded in the 10th century by people whose first names were Salazar, Helder, Harry Potter. 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 Does anybody have a think you're on 26, I think you were on 26. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think I told myself that, right, Mike. Okay. Sorry. Stick the mic, yeah. Next one, 23. In American restaurants, which phrase describes a dish containing both seafood and meat? Uh, it's Deb's. Surf and turf. Surf and turf, yeah. yeah. Sorry. Right, 24. Who is the father of Lord Frederick Windsor? It's mine. Uh, it's Edward. It's incorrect. <coughs> Elliot. Snowden. No. Lakeup. Louis Mountbatten. No. Mike. Edward. No. It's not the main thing like that, is it? Go on. A rose. Prince Albert. No. <coughs> oh, no. Mike. I don't no. guess so. Mike. Uh, oh. Jacob Kent. Don't know, not Jacob Kent. No. no, Prince Michael of Kent. Yeah, Michael. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Twenty-five. Uh, whiplash. Club. <laughs> Hit. J. T. Simmons. Sorry. J. P. Simmons. No. Which point? Miles no. yes. Teller. Sorry. Miles Teller. No. Who's oh. the point? Uh, Sam. Drums. No. Lakebuck. Metallica. No. Oh, I know what it is now. Whiplash, Clawful, Trapjaw, Merman, oh. and Beastman. Oh. Henchman yes. of which cartoon villain? Oh. <laughs> Anyone? No. Uh, Rose? Skeletor. 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 Oh. 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 Nice question. Um, um, the first half million pound transfer between two English football clubs saw David Mills transfer to West Bromwich Albion from which club? Five. Five. Well, I guess Middlesbrough. Middlesbrough, yeah. <laughs> oh, this <laughs> is <five. laughs> Come on, this is a transfer. Come on. <laughs> Gift. Uh, in 2014, he changed his surname to Salvador. Previous. <laughs> Rhodes. Charles Bronson. Charles Bronson, yeah. Twenty-one, you're on all together. Come on for this round. Twenty-eight. Created by. Oh, Luke. Sorry, are we ready? Yeah. Created by Luke Creswell and Steve McNicholas in 1991. What is the name of the musical act, which has a long-running shows in the London West End and Las Vegas, which uses everyday items as percussion instruments? 
Nej, stomp. 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 Ja. What is the name of the band Step? Second and last UK sing number one single. It's <coughs> Kid. Heartbeat. No. Martin. Stomp. Stomp again, yeah? yeah. Oh, oh, oh really? <laughs> well done, Martin. And the last one, once we get the win. Uh, what word is used by American retailers to describe the last Saturday before Christmas? Sam. Uh, We're not over, by the way. Yeah. Black Saturday. No, one away. Late clock. Super Saturday. Super Saturday, yeah. No, it's just me then. I'm back to him hating the answer to this stuff. Lake up, got it. Two. So, uh, Sam and Clive drew that down. Seven so, off. Is that correct? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yes.